right, everybody, welcome back. My cash flower community, Matthew Pillmore here, your cash flow coach. And to my right again, Mr. Michael Matthew. If you don't recognize this guy, you're gonna to wanna to make sure you check the links in the description and watch the rest of the videos that he and I have done together. It talks all about making anywhere between fifteen dollars to $30,000 every month with a new high income side hustle. And that's a very realistic income stream for somebody that's willing to put in 15, 20, 25 hours or more each week. Um, those numbers can get even more ridiculous. We've brought in case studies, we've brought in testimonials, and we've showcased how it's actually happening. And we have a number of you guys now from the channel that are succeeding with this. And I wanna keep featuring it, I wanna keep challenging these guys, I wanna keep asking the tough questions that you guys are leaving in comments below. Now we are sitting here in the new short-term rental. I'm so, so thrilled about this. Guys, we're gonna to continue to bring you episodes about that as well. We did a recent collaboration with Short-Term Rental University here on YouTube. Mr. R Richard Fertig, amazing time, amazing experience, and we're confident we're gonna pull at least $10,000 a month from this property, and we believe that over the next few years, we have ideas that will allow this one property alone to bring in at least $50,000 a month in income. That's on one property, folks. So we want you guys to be sharing in these types of personal experiences for yourself, we want these circumstances to be yours and your families as well because it's provided ridiculous amounts of freedom for us. We call this a lifestyle asset. It means that we get to enjoy our lifestyles and we build it the way we want and we live life and, and, and use these, uh, these great houses for ourselves, but then we make a ton of money from them on the side. So that's for another day. Today, uh, on this episode, we wanted to just cut a real quick video and talk briefly about the support that's offered by Little Pink Houses of America in order to earn that 15 to 30 and more each and every month. So uh, that was one of the things that stuck out to me when we had Tan on, which she is just killing it in her first three months of doing Little Pink Houses of America. She's got tons of properties under contract. She's got properties that are closing now. So I wanted you to elaborate. I, I asked you to come in here and give us some specific d detail about, hey, what, what do you guys do to really kind of be the wind in the sails mm -hmm. of, of your affiliates or your um, future franchise uh, franchisees? Is yeah. that what they're called? Yeah, soon to be uh, franchisees. We're in the final formal stages of franchising. It's cost us deep into six figures and better half of six months, but we are at almost towards the finish line right cool. now. Cool, congratulations. Everyone that's already on board, uh, and they're very aware that they will automatically convert, as you've talked about in subsequent videos, um, uh, the price will go up when that happens. It's rising now, it's based on supply and demand. It's already expensive, guys. Here's the thing, it's expensive to people who have not run businesses before. Uh, the cost of what you guys charge is what I have to spend on my business every single month, right? On my businesses, my businesses cost what it costs to get involved with you mm -hmm. just one time. I have to pay that month in and month out. So if you're not used to being an entrepreneur, you're gonna come in and you may experience sticker shock. We went into all the prices on another video that we'll link as well, but um, yeah, the prices are expected to almost double, if not more than double, depending on which membership you're going with, right? Yeah, that's exactly correct. And it really does pale in comparison with startup cost or capital required to open up other franchises right. out there. And we're certainly not gonna compare ourselves to a, you know, a McDonald's or a Subway, although we do have uh, grandiose aspirations. I think we'll get there at some point. Uh, you know, you're talking a million bucks there and you're selling subs, you know, five bucks a, a, mm. at a time. Mm -hmm. With our model, depending on where you come in, and we've talked about those uh, in other videos, Videos, you can recover your initial investment anywhere from two to five deals, which we anticipate everyone will be able to do that inside of six months. Yeah, that's incredible, guys. Look, if you if you can recover what you invested to build a business like this that earns you tens of thousands every month and do so within six months, you better be taking a strong look at that or you're not an entrepreneur or this just is not the actual business model for you and that's okay as well. But. But definitely those numbers make sense, right? Yeah, that's the best part about our model is the, it's the math. You right. know, not only math for seller, obviously it works for buyer. And profit's not a bad word in our world. We never right. shy away from that. We can do business the right way, which is part of our company culture and part of our core beliefs. And we don't uh, compromise that for anyone, period regardless of the amount of money that we can make. But when we can do good business by all parties involved and we can turn a nice profit, uh, obviously we love what we do. We can look at ourselves in the mirror and all those kind of cliche things, if you will, but that's important to us. Um, one of the questions we frequently get though is, you know, it is a bit of a leap of faith. I can give people references all day long. 
But no one gives bad references. That's true. Yeah, well, no, there are people that give bad references. I mean, you, you had somebody that was picking on you online, and I asked you about that in one of our videos too, right? I mean, yeah, there is there, there can be I'm bad talking reviews. about a direct reference. If someone were to sure. ask me, you know, let me talk to someone that's already been working with you. And we are happy to share those. Obviously, it kind of detracts from some of their day-to-day -day business, but we do that on occasion. But right. I can tell you all day long what corporate support looks like. Obviously, you've had some videos on the channel here that have shared their personal experiences with us, but no one wants to invest, I don't care if it's $10,000 or $50,000 or soon to be $100,000 plus in our model, and then think that they're gonna be out there on an island by themselves. Mm. You know, kind of our catchphrase, if you will, is be in business for yourself, but not by yourself. Okay. We are locking arms with these folks. They are true partners. They're representing our brand and our business model. We've got very high expectations for where we're gonna be in the next two to three, four, five years. And in order for us to achieve our corporate goals, each one of our affiliate soon to be franchisees has to be able to stand alone successfully. Mm -hmm. We're cognizant of our growth, and that's important because some people just want to start a business and they kind of catch that lightning in a bottle, if you will, and they just want to explode. Well, hyper growth is almost worse than no growth. Okay, yeah. If that's you true. don't have infrastructure to support it, so what we've done is we're literally hiring people every single week mm. at this point from corporate to support our affiliate franchisees. They have to be able to stand alone successfully. So just this year alone, we've already opened up, I, I believe over 30 affiliate franchisees. So internally, we're ecstatic about that, but now it's we have to have infrastructure to support them. Mm -hmm. So not only from day-to-day -day coaching, uh, marketing, um, you know, folks that are working with them on uh, generating leads, our call center. We're building our call center each and every week to get that front line, that first contact on behalf of our affiliates, having acquisition specialists that are available to, to help them get contracts, working with them on their marketing, uh, helping them qualify the buyers. The closing coordinator role is uh, it's critical and paramount to their success, uh, particularly during the early days. Now, all of this at some point, they may kind of kick us out of the nest, mm -hmm. depending on where they're at in their, in their model and, and kind of growth. But, you know, we're taking the deals across the finish line. So each and every day, and, and we preach this to people, if they put in the time, if they follow the blueprint, because we've made all the mistakes, mm -hmm. right, which is exactly. important to remember. We've been doing this a long time. Mm -hmm. The advantage that your viewers have and people that are coming on board with us is they've learned from our mistakes without having to actually pay the price or right, pay the exactly. pipe. They just do what you say to do and not do what you say not to do. Right? That's, that's exactly okay. right. And it sounds elementary, but the reality is a lot of people, you know, will kind of, and, and not necessarily in our world, but just I think life in general want to, you know, they can have a blueprint. They can, you, you can map it out for them. This is exactly what you need to do and why those people don't just follow that is mind boggling, mm -hmm. but that is the reality. That is the world that we live in. If people will follow our blueprint, lean on corporate, again, sounds elementary. Why wouldn't you take advantage of every support mechanism given to you? If they do that and they put in the time, they will, they'll succeed. Mm -hmm. If they are not willing to do any part of that, A, we don't want their money. B, they're not the right partner for us, and C, if they were to try and come on board and not follow those directives, they might as well like the crap shoot, right? I mean, it's just a gamble. Though. Yeah, so one of the first things that we bring to the table with these folks, obviously, we don't have to wait on this, so we've got a lot of housekeeping items that we start with right out of the gate. Once we've got the agreement in place and obviously are funded, we build their website, they get business cards, they get email addresses, mm. uh, they're set up with all the different departments within our organization that will make a remote touch to them, get them on their calendars, start kind of pushing the ball down the road. But the really first formal step is getting them into our Jacksonville corporate office. So we hold a four day training once a month and that's where all of these like-minded people are coming in from around the country. We've got one right now, we've got I believe 12 or 13. Right, your team's running one while you're here. Right. right. Now. The, uh, it's moment. actually starting, uh, yeah, starting, starting this week. Uh, mm -hmm. So I'm going to miss the first day of it, and that's okay. Um, got a great staff there, which is really, you know, not only are they getting a four-day, you know, kind of boot camp training, if you will, from A to Z on the business model, and it's a general overview. And we always tell people and kind of say it with a smile, you're going to be drinking from a fire hose. The best part about it, though, is you leave there and we're partners. Mm. So anything you didn't digest, anything that's kind of rolling around in your head where dots are not connected, and we can do our best, 
but it is, you know, there's a lot of moving parts right, and that's exactly. fortunately they don't have to remember all of it. They've got a full team. They're meeting their entire support staff over that four days. And uh, it's just really cool. Uh, it, it's very cool. So everyone meets really as strangers, mm. you know, that first day. And by the end of it, everyone's exchanging information, you know, hugging it out. We've had some tears in there, tears of joy. Um, but it's, uh, it's very unique and we've got a very, you know, kind of faith, ba- faith based, um, you know, family oriented mm. uh, business and, you know, get these people in town and they're all starting at the same, you know, same, everyone's starting at that, you know, that start line and they're all trying to get to the same place. So that kind of crosstalk is, is really neat. I'd be remiss if I didn't share that. It's a huge component of the success in our folks. And I love that. And know, it's each and every month so they can come back if they want to. Uh, it's unlimited, unlimited. Wow. So also we're going to have a, I believe, drop a video on building a team. So if at any point, uh, whether it's from the outset or months down the road, they bring, you know, a brother or sister or a spouse or someone from the outside onto their team at no charge, uh, they can obviously come back down to Jacksonville corporate and go, and go through that uh, boot camp, if you will. Really right. And so through. when you drink out of the fire hose to begin with, it becomes more and more digestible as you repeat it. So the redundancy of that, I think, is key mm-hmm. when you're dealing with business. Um, you know, the king of learning is repetition. So that's fabulous. Yeah. Guys, and I think this is what stood out to me, not just from Tan's video and testimonial about their support, but we have crowds of you guys from the channel going to their three-day introductory workshop every time it comes around at this point. So you guys are making up in, in many cases the bulk of the audience. It's phenomenal. I mean, there, there are so many of you that are latching onto this opportunity. And again, if you're not real familiar with the other videos, that's where you wanna start. You wanna just get in and watch everything we've cut together. It's probably still you know, under two hours worth of content at this point. Mm-hmm. If you're not willing to commit a couple hours just to do your upfront leg work, this isn't a good fit for you either. You have to actually take some action here. Whether you want results in what we do from our coaching standpoint, which is how do we optimize cash flow? How do we make the best decisions when it comes to banking and borrowing? How do we maximize the three C's of proper banking and borrowing, credit, capital, and cash flow? Or whether you're doing something like Little Pink Houses of America, taking one step and putting it in front of the last over and over again throughout the day, forcing yourself to make multiple challenging decisions every single day is paramount to success. There's not a day that goes by that I'm not faced with a lot of challenging decisions that need to be made at this Mm -hmm. point. But that's also part of the reason why we're such huge advocates of having support around you in general. I think it's a great conversation for all entrepreneurs, for all people that are chasing success, that are wanting to magnetize success. You better be surrounded by a great team, which means that you better also have your free coaching session from VIP scheduled. And if you're not willing to wait seven, eight, nine months for that free coaching session, you can always claim one of our quick start vacancies. We do have a limited number of those as well. Make sure you check out all the videos with Little Pink Houses and make sure you email pink at vipfinancialeducation.com after you've seen those videos. Make sure you include a first and last name and make sure you include direct contact phone number so that Michael and his team can reach out to you directly. And let's see, see if it's a good fit. It may not be, chances are it's not. And if it's not a good fit, wonderful, you've explored it, you've made the informed decision and you're moving on to another opportunity. But who knows, maybe it's the perfect fit and maybe it's exactly what you've been looking for, for that high income skill of the wealth pyramid that Dan Locke and I collaborated about. By the way guys, we've got another million plus subscriber collaboration coming up. That's the second of the year. We're on fire, we're making such good content guys. So. Be on the lookout for all these incredible collaborations. And in the meantime, check these guys out if you're interested in making 30K or more every single month. Guys, we'll see you on the next video. Make sure you subscribe or drop a like on the video and comment below for any questions that we've left unanswered regarding Little Pink Houses. We're gonna keep showing you the success stories and the testimonials and the case studies. And we're gonna break down the math and we're gonna give you every last detail we possibly can. And I'm gonna keep trying to ask the tough questions on your behalf since you can't be here with us today. Until we see you on the next one, make it a great day today and take care. First question I like to ask is how did you hear about Little Pink House of America? Through VIP. VIP VIP Financial, Financial, yeah. Online. We actually are part of VIP Financial and our coach told us about it. Oh, gotcha. You want to shout out your coach? Hey, Joe. What's up, Joe? Joe, Joe. Hey, we appreciate it. Yeah, we definitely do. (laughs) Awesome, cool. Um, Any real estate experience before coming down here? I have zero, none whatsoever. Well, I have experience with a uh, another company. I won't say who it is, but 
<laughs> but um, it definitely uh, just in wholesaling and just um, learning the material. But um, that's pretty much it as far as real estate gotcha. background. Mm -hmm. Okay, and this could turn into six because there's two of you. But what are the three biggest takeaways from the last four days? Oh man! Oh, just the making homeowners. That's it. Just it just resonate with me. Those who. You know whether they're going through certain situations you know life-changing situations or you know were denied for a loan previously or whatever it is and this is an opportunity another option for them to be a homeowner so that definitely resonates with me yeah mine's a lot more superficial <laughs> <laughs> see i was but thinking the about perks of allowing the someone people. to get into a home where yeah. they couldn't do it before is also great that's yeah. just incentive in the program for me so yeah